This video is a follow up to the earlier one I uploaded today regarding the PCV valve cleaning video. Now my objective was more to try and get people to know that this thing is here and that they need to clean it. If you want to see that video, it's in the top right hand corner right now. But Fu Manchu, one of our viewers who regularly comments and very, very knowledgeable, made point that if you drill random holes into these valves, they do cause excessive oil return in high quantities if not done right. And my experience was it probably exactly that. I think I did this mod with the drilling of the PCV a few years ago. And my experience was that it just returned a significant amount of oil back into the intake. And for that reason, I went back to the standard hole size and just kept maintaining it each service. Now, based on Fu Manchu's comments today, I decided to pull my spare PCV I have, drill a 2 and 1.5 mil hole on the bottom and drill a 3 mil hole on the top. Soak it and clean it and then install it into my Adventura. blow these out and then apparently the top gets three I have to push hard just gently there we go Not as essential as I would like it, but I don't think that matters. Alright. And now we'll just drop it into this, which I've placed here. Well, there's no real point in this time lapse, but it's more just to show you uh, how much breakdown you get from the PCV valve and that I just want to remind everyone that not everything I post is 100% correct. It takes a community of you guys and everyone's experience to work out what is the best thing for stuff like this. So if you think that you've done something or you know for a fact that a, a method you know is better or more correct or is correct, then it's always good to comment because we take constructive feedback here, guys. And if it does work for you, and maybe I've got it wrong. I'm very open to trying it because if it's a better the way, it's better than the way I'm doing it. I want to do it, and I want to teach everyone else that way as well. All right, guys. Oof, look at that PCV. Now the time lapse is going. It's been about six hours now. So. Ow! I've got cuts on my hands, and I can really feel that. Let's have a look. So that's kind of what it looks like. Um, with a 1.5 and a 2 mil drill hold, hole. I don't know why they have to be different sizes and that's a 3 mil hole on the top. Could get the air pressure hose and put it through it. What I might actually do, since I've got a smaller hole at the bottom, might just spray some clean fluid. Look at that. Probably should do it this way so you guys can see. So I go on to do this for about 10 minutes until hardly anything's coming out. Um, you'll see there's just so much in this, even though it was only soaked for six hours. Probably soaking it overnight would be better, but just, just gives you an idea of what you're dealing with. You can see, you can actually see through it now. Alright, well, I'm going to go try and chuck that in, in my car. Um, and see what that looks like after using it for... A few months, 
and then I'll check it out again at the next service. But that's going by what um, a few people said. I didn't realise that there were specific size holes that you needed, so I never tried it with this 3mm, 2 and 1.5. So we'll see if that actually makes a difference. Different in hole sizes. That actually looks similar, but not. But that is definitely two mils, and that's 1.5. That actually looks like it might have actually been done, maybe. Okay. That's on. And we'll check back in a few months' time.